Alright, hi guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to get a quality boost on your video. Um, this helps for video games mostly because it gives it a little more, a better look to it. Uh, this is a little clip from one of my montages. On well, my last montage, actually, a 360 RPG. That was pretty sweet. Um, okay, first off, what you want to do, you go down to, uh, that's the one. Video FX down here in your little fucking thing that helps you down here. Then you go to saturation adjust. I already have a preset for this, so I'm gonna drag it all the way up to, our, to my clip and put it in there. Now, as you may see, it's a little better looking and it's not as dull. Your your settings may look a little different right now. If you just like, you can just pull any one of these in. And then you want to put your amount to 100, center all the way down, and spread all the way up. Now this will make your video look so much better in quality, because it really does boost your quality. And you can just leave these two alone. And you can just save it as a preset, like Call of Duty, or anything like that. That's one thing that boosts it. And also, if you don't want to like put it on every clip, I'll show you real quick. You can just like drag it in here and drop it. It worked for me the other day. I don't know why it's not. There it is. Then you can just add it to every clip. It'll be right down here on one of your video things. That way you don't have to add it to every single clip. And you can just remove it like that. Also, another thing that helps is uh, sharpening your video. Uh, this works for. This works for mostly video games, once again. If it moves a lot, it'll make it look a lot better, and you'll be able to see. Then you just drag that, and once again, you can just, like, if you did, did, if you don't have any videos in there, you can just, like, drag it, and it'll be in all your clips. It may look a little choppy right now. You Oh, you want to use the medium for, like, Call of Duty or any of them. Some of them you may want to use light. It may look like a little choppy right now and a little too sharpened, but once like you see it on YouTube, it'll look a lot better. And then it goes from this, then from okay, as you can see, it looks a lot better. And then I'll go back and I'll show you what it looked like before. And this is what it looked like before looks a little dull and then when you sharpen and all that it looks so much better this is a quick tutorial but is very useful to boost your quality um, and I'm loving this fucking widescreen effect that YouTube just put in and make it fucking 340 by 360 so you guys might want to render your montages or whatever as 640 by 360 that way it'll get that widescreen effect. We don't have the effect, but it'll fit the fucking widescreen on YouTube. But once again, quick t quick and helpful tutorial. Um, I'll see you guys next week. And look out for my montage. This fucking... It'll be out uh, sometimes, sometime around Thanksgiving. I already have like five or six minutes worth of good footage. I haven't been recording lately. haven't played a lot. Just been chilling on the computer and doing my schoolwork and shit. So look out for my montage somewhere around Thanksgiving. It'll be coming out and I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Alright, I'll see you guys next week. Peace.